Hi, sturdy women. Welcome back. I hope you're having a good week. I hope you're feeling good in your body. Today, I want to talk about massage guns and how massage guns can be a useful tool in your lipedema self-care protocol. Before I talk about that, though, I want to say a big welcome to all of our new subscribers. We're so glad to have you in our community. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click below. You'll get a notification every time I make a new Sturdy Woman video. And if today's information or anything else on the channel is helpful to you, please do like and share so that we can reach more women and give them hope and help on their journey. Massage guns, who does not love the sound of that, right? We all know that massage guns are a useful tool for relieving tight, sore, knotted muscles. Yes, I'm massaging my neck and my shoulders because that's where I always have tension, but massage guns can also be really helpful for those of us with lymphatic conditions. The vibrations from the massage gun is gonna allow you to give really targeted support to areas where you might feel congested, where you might be having pain. What those vibrations are gonna do is increase the circulation, improve the lymph flow. You can also use a massage gun to help either prevent or start breaking up existing fibrosis that you might have from your lipedema. With this, I'm going to caution you're gonna to wanna to go slow. It might be uncomfortable. Listen to your body and do not do more than your body is ready for. Um, if you are working on fibrosis, I would also recommend that you work with someone from your care team, maybe um, a lymphedema or lipedema therapist who's given you manual lymph drainage, someone like that who can really kind of help um, monitor and support you while you're doing that what to look for in a massage gun. So I recommend looking for one that comes with different heads. This is my favorite one to use. It's kind of like a hard round foam, but look for a massage gun that comes with maybe four or five different heads. There are different ones that you can use um, that are kind of specialized for different parts of the body, different types of massage. So, you know, maybe you want something that's really hard and, and intense one day and something that's a little bit more gentle the next day. Being able to change out the head is gonna really allow you to customize the massage for what your body needs that day. And similarly, look for something that comes with a, a wide variety of different speeds. Some days you're gonna want that real gentle support and you really just want the vibration to help increase that circulation and the lymph flow. Maybe some days you have some soreness, some pain, you're working on fibrosis and you want something a little bit more intense. So look for a massage gun that's gonna give you that flexibility to really customize to what your body needs that specific day. In my opinion, uh, the price of a massage gun, you can spend as much as you want, you can spend as little as you want, right? The, the prices, if you look online, are gonna range from like $20 up to $300. In my non-expert opinion, but my opinion, I think you can get a really good massage gun for $100 honestly less. Um, if you go over to sturdywoman.com, I have a number of massage guns that I like that I think are really kind of good models. Uh, and those are really competitively priced. Um, so if you're unsure what to look for, what um, might be a good choice for you, you can head over and see some of the ones that I recommend. Um, if you've got a really expensive massage gun and you think it was worth it, go ahead and, and put below in, in the comments. We'd love to hear that. Um, and if you have one and, and you have things that, that you've used it for and found it helpful for, go ahead and also put that below so that we can all learn from each other. To check out the massage guns that I recommend, head over to sturdywoman.com. You can also read more about my journey or shoot me an email. I'd love to hear from you. And that's it. I'll see you next week. Bye.